Hey guys, what is up and welcome back to the channel. So this video's announcement is going to be either an awesome thing for some people or a terrible thing for others. This video is just a quick announcement to let you know that CMU 1.13.1 is now available to download for all CMU Patreon supporters. As I previously said, some of you guys are going to be excited for this release and some of you guys are not going to like it at all. So let's cover the guys who aren't going to like it. So if you're like me and you have been eagerly awaiting the release of the new texture cache rewrite, unfortunately that is not going to be a part of this build, mostly due to the fact that it is still way, way too buggy to go into any kind of mainline release. If you want to check the status of this texture cache rewrite, you can simply do so by heading on over to the CMU Discord. There is a very specific channel on that Discord which is dedicated to the support and development of this texture cache rewrite. You can find a link to the CMU official Discord in the description of this video. Okay, so let's take a look at some of the reasons why you should be excited for this new CMU release. According to initial reports and some of my initial testing in games, this CMU release has fixed tons and tons of sound issues in CMU games. If you were not aware, there are several games that have fairly significant sound issues in CMU emulator. Some of these include, but are not limited to, Super Smash Bros. 4, Puckin Tournament and Bayonetta 2. Speaking about the latter, Bayonetta 2 has also seen a massive increase and has seen three of its soft locking instances completely removed in this new CMU version. So while these games will need further testing by both myself and my community, even if half of these sound issues and soft locking problems have been fixed, it will still be an absolutely enormous step in the development of CMU as an emulator. So I'm going to be doing my full changelog video in which I discuss all of these changes and how they affect all of your games on the emulator itself in the next day or so. Keep an eye out for that video on the channel. Okay, so with this Patreon release coming today, the 28th of August, this means that the free public release is going to go live on September the 4th. So as I have done in the past 4 or 5 months of CMU releases, if you want me to test any of your games on this new CMU release, all you'll need to do is leave your game title in a comment down below this video. In the next day or so, I will go through all of the comments and pick the top 10 most requested games for testing and I will cover each and every one of them in their own dedicated video. Once again guys, cheers for checking out this video, remember to like it if you liked it, dislike it if you didn't, and as always, subscribe to the channel if you want to see all future videos from me.